Hello everyone, welcome to Financial Success. Today we have to talk about the KuCoin community chain as they have released their mainnet just a couple of weeks ago. And they already have different cryptocurrencies that are joining their public chain and so I'd like to go through a tutorial of how to buy KCC tokens such as Coffee or Kudo. And so if you find this information in this video helpful, please hit the like button, I'd really appreciate it. It really helps out the channel. Also, this is not financial advice, this is just a tutorial on how to buy these cryptocurrencies. And also, if you would like to get two free stocks from Webull, there is a link below. If you just deposit $5, this is a limited time offer, so if, they, if you are interested in that, definitely check it out. And so let's get into it. Let's take a look at KuCoin Community Chain. And so their mission is to accelerate the flow of value around the world. And so KCC is built by KCS and KuCoin fan communities. KuCoin Community Chain is decentralized public chain with high performance. And so its purpose is to solve the problems such as low performance and high cost of public chain. And so to provide community users with faster, more convenient and low cost experiences. And so this is very similar to say BNB or Binance Smart Chain. And so Binance Smart Chain is a platform that is built from the exchange of Binance. And then KuCoin has now built their own chain as well. And so that is known as KCC. And so they have a few advantages here as well. And so this is fully compatible with Ethereum and ERC20 smart contracts with extremely low cost in migration. So you can switch over those Ethereum coins to the KCC chain easily. And so KuCoin token KCS is the only fuel and native token for KCC and can be used to pay gas fees. And so this may explain why we are seeing a big surge in KCS recently. And so this may continue as we see more and more projects moving to KCC. And so the blocks are produced every three seconds, accelerated transaction confirmation and higher chain performance. And then they also adopt the consensus algorithm of proof of staked authority, which is more efficient, secure and robust. And so as I mentioned, this was released here a couple of weeks ago on June 16th, and then they had their testnet back in April. And so there's many new cryptocurrencies that are building on KCC or projects that are moving to the KuCoin community chain. And so that's where I would like to introduce CoffeeSwap. And so this is a decentralized exchange on the KuCoin community chain that can be used to purchase these cryptocurrencies. And so we can see that the D app is hosted at coffeeswap.exchange. And so that is the website that you have to go to to get access to this. And so we can see here this is CoffeeSwap. They do have a pro, basic, and expert, depending on what options you would like to have. And then one thing I really do like about this is they have charts. And so this is one thing I definitely think that is missing from like pancake swap. And so I definitely think this is a huge improvement from those decentralized exchanges. And so we can see here that I am showing KCS. And so this has done very well over the last couple of days. It was trading around $8 just the other day. And then it hit a high of 14. It is now trading just above $13. And so I think this cryptocurrency will continue to do well as more coins move over to KCC. And so you can also see down here, there's a chart. You can see buy, sell. We can also see the transactions if we were to pick another coin here. So we can see what buy and sell orders are going through. And then you can also find some information about that cryptocurrency. And so let's take a look here of how to actually purchase these cryptocurrencies. The first thing that you're going to have to do is connect a wallet. And so at the top up here, you can either set up a MetaMask or you can have wallet connect. And so I have went ahead and set up a MetaMask account. And so let's go ahead and get started with how to buy these cryptocurrencies with MetaMask. And so here at the top, you will have to change this to a custom RPC from the Ethereum mainnet. And so you will have to fill out this information here. And so I do have this article here with the information that has to be entered. And so I will be posting this below the video if you're interested in checking it out. And so we can see here, this is the information that you must manually enter. And so we can see the network name, the new RPC URL, the chain ID, the currency symbol, which is optional, and then the block explorer URL, which is also optional. And so I recommend pulling these from this article as they seem to work. And so we can see we can go back to this MetaMask. And since I have entered them before, I can just go ahead and click and add these. However, you have to manually enter them yourself. And so once those have been added here, we can go ahead and click save. And then we can see that the KCC has been added. And so I can go ahead and close this window at the top here, and then it will ask to connect with MetaMask. And so I will go ahead and select next, and then I'm gonna select next. And so now the MetaMask bot has been connected to the CoffeeSwap exchange. And so once I deposit KCS tokens, I can then buy those cryptocurrencies on CoffeeSwap. And so the first thing I need to do is to go to KuCoin here. And so I am on my main account. And so this is what you need to do to be able to withdraw KCS tokens. And so if you do not have a KuCoin account, there is a link down below if you're interested in signing up. And so here we can see that I have five KCS tokens and I am going to be withdrawing those. 
And so we can see it brings me to this page here. It will be important to make sure to select KCC here, and then you will be pasting that wallet address from MetaMask. And so you can copy it from the top up here as well. If you'd like to see the entire address, you can go to account details and you can copy it from here as well. And so this is very good to confirm this. You wanna make sure that you are transferring to the correct wallet. And so you can go back to KuCoin and you can paste the wallet address, and then you will select how much you want to withdraw. And so I'm gonna go ahead and withdraw the full amount of KCS that is in my main account. And so I'm going to be withdrawing five KCS. And so I'm going to go ahead and confirm this and hit confirm withdraw. And then it is going to have me fill out these as well. And so, and so once I have completed those security steps, I'm going to go ahead down here. We can see that this transaction is in process. And so there was five being transferred. And so we can go back to the MetaMask here and refresh the page. And so I now will have five KCS tokens in my MetaMask wallet. And so that did not take very long. It is much faster than like pancake swap. And then from here, I'm gonna go back to coffee swap and then decide what I would like to purchase. And so I'm gonna be using the basic exchange here. And so we can see that I have five KCS tokens and then I'm gonna be purchasing coffee. And so if you would like to buy a different cryptocurrency that is not on here, you can actually include the address for the KCC token that you're looking to purchase. And so I'm gonna be buying 100% of that. And so four or five tokens, I will be receiving 4.91 coffee coins. And so one thing to also keep in mind is depending on what cryptocurrencies you are buying, they may ask you to increase the slippage tolerance. And so you can do that up here in the settings. And so I'm going to go ahead and proceed with this transaction. I'm going to swap and then I'm going to hit confirm swap. And so we will see that is waiting for confirmation through the MetaMask through my extension in Google Chrome. And so I will hit confirm here and that will process. And so we can see that the transaction has been submitted and I can go ahead and add coffee to MetaMask. And so I will go ahead and do that. And so I'm gonna add the token and then I will hit close. And so we can go over to the MetaMask wallet here. We can see that I have 54.54 coffee coins. And so prior to this video, I had 50 coins myself and then we just transferred four and a half. And so we can see that that can work. And so this video can be applied to different cryptocurrencies that are built on the KCC chain. And so if you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button. I'd really appreciate it. It definitely helps out the channel and I hope to see you in the next video.